my blood sugar is low when I wake up, or my blood sugar is low before breakfast, what should I do? Let me further explain the situation here. Let's say my blood sugar is low before breakfast or in the middle of the night, and I'm taking long-acting insulin but not taking short-acting insulin. And I may also be on some other medications, non-insulin medications for diabetes. In this kind of situation, what should I do? Or let me give you a more specific example. Let's say I'm taking 20 units of Lantus once a day, and I'm also taking metformin for diabetes. And my blood sugar is in the 50s or 60s before breakfast on multiple days. So this happens frequently. But my blood sugar is higher later in the day, maybe around 120, 130, which is good, or maybe even higher, 180, 190, 200. And in this kind of situation, what should I do? What should I do to reduce or prevent low blood sugar before breakfast or at night? The solution is to reduce low-acting insulin dose by about 30%. Then monitor blood sugar for a few days to see if additional reduction is necessary. Now let's go back to the example. In this example, we should reduce the insulin lantus dose by about 30%, from 20 units to about 14 units once a day, and continue to monitor fasting blood sugar for a few days. If you continue to have frequent low numbers, then further reduce Lantus dose by another 30%, so maybe 9 units once a day, so on and so forth. One thing to pay attention is after you reduce the low acting insulin dose, the blood sugar in the morning may become normal, but blood sugar later in the day may rise as well and become too high. So let's say in the past, before you change the dose, blood sugar in the morning was 50, 60, and blood sugar later in the day was 150, 160. After reducing the insulin dose, then blood sugar will rise throughout the whole day. It will become 100, 110, 120 before breakfast, so it's good, it's no longer low, but it may go up to 200 or 220 later in the day. So in that kind of situation, what should you do? first thing you can do is to reduce carbohydrate in your diet so hopefully your blood sugar does not jump so much uh, later in the day or after meals. If that is not good enough, then you will have to take additional medications to reduce blood sugar spikes after meals. If you would like to know more about which diabetes medications specifically target blood sugar spikes after meals, then you can look it up on hmf-diabetes.com.